Hello guys, this girl got game and we are very, very quiet as we are starting our other bad endings, the bad endings under the others tab. So we're starting back with our saint boy after a little while away from him. And this time we are going to start this bad ending by not talking to Finn, which we have picked before in another bad ending. So let's do that and then we'll start skipping ahead. So as far as I understand, all these bad endings involve Finn in some way, shape, or form. <laughs> so hold on to your butts. <laughs> we are going to, uh, get this party started. I thought it would be good to see the context of these scenes before we do Finn's route next time. Because all of this was part of the base game. And after Finn was added as DLC, these endings were not moved over to Finn's tab. So I'm like... Okay, let's see them before we get into DLC shenanigans and grand endings and all that fun stuff. So that's the plan. <sighs> we'll see how it goes. Fingers crossed we make it through okay. <laughs> um, okay, we do what we did in the good ending. I would love to. Only one more choice. <laughs> what an interesting combination of stuff. This is also from the good ending. Apparently this is gonna lead to... I guess because we didn't talk to Finn, but things are going good with Yune? Oh no. Finn, what are you about to do? Well, at least we got to see our boy smile in the night sky of Libralitas. How are we with you, your holiness? Pretty good. You know, we were, we were, we were happy. <laughs> For a time. What's the context? Okay. So we had the whole, our shadows arced across each other, only to separate again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> Alright. <clears throat> Finn, I'm sorry I didn't talk to you. Please go easy on me. Hmm? I feel like someone is looking at us. What's wrong? Nothing. I must be imagining it, but I couldn't shake off that feeling. I don't know a lot about the ducks. We shouldn't stay here for long. So apparently, even though Finn said, oh, you didn't have to like, you didn't have to talk to me and apologize, but it was really good that she chose to in the end. I think it's funny that Finn always likes to pop up in Libra Lita's at night and is like, my girl's having fun with another guy that isn't me. In initiate murder mode. <laughs> uh, Saint Yune, we should go back. Aw, already? He deliberately puffed his cheeks out like a little child. Yes, the little child needs to be tucked into bed now, otherwise they won't grow taller. I played along and smiled innocently at him. Really? I hope I'll grow a little taller. Then I can look down on you. <laughs> he spun around and ran away. <laughs> Yune. He really doesn't act like a saint. His believers in the heights would have fainted upon seeing him like that. I felt like I had gained something. Like I was someone special to him. But obviously that can't be true. One day, I will have to kill him or die myself. I knew that I wasn't going to be able to dodge this fate. But still, I prayed that it would be as far in the future as possible as I watched him run away. <laughs> Something hit me on the head. Ow! W what? I collapsed on the ground. Oh. St. Yune didn't notice and vanished into the darkness. No, Yune! You abandoned me to my fate. I guess you could argue my prayer was answered. <laughs> the day is very far in the future now. My vision faded, and I was plunged into darkness as well. Oh boy. That's not a good sound. That's not a sound you want to hear. Water. In the depths of my unconsciousness, I heard drops of water. Are we in the tunnels underneath? Pick, pick. 
It was a quiet melody. Oh, yeah, we're in the sewers. The drops grew louder and more frequent. Steadily they grew until it reached a torrent that ripped my mind back to reality. Is this gonna be a cage situation? Are we about to be like in a cage in the tunnels? In the sewers? That would be a really good place to hide her though. Actually. Ooh. My head hurts. My senses returned as well. I could move my limbs. Good, I wasn't dead. Then what happened? Then... Mm -mm. Oh, good. I thought you might not wake up. Someone is here. I remembered his voice from somewhere. Don't force yourself. You should rest a little longer. Yes. I knew his voice. Finn? Is that you? Yes. Long time no see, Cyrus. Oh, he didn't take us to the sewer. He took us over here. Are you going to drown me? Aw, oh, man. Don't do this, Finn. Not like this. I opened my eyes and saw Finn. My head was placed on his lap. Where's my picture of that? I tried to sit up, but my head hurt too much. Are you all right? I think I hit you too hard. Hit? Me? You... Yes. I didn't want to hurt you, but I had to separate you from St. Uni. It was my only option. Why did you want us separated? What are you talking about? St. Uni was alone in the city now. That was a big problem. No, don't move, please. Your head must still hurt. Yeah, and whose fault is that? Damn, girl, get it. I ground my teeth and forced myself to sit up. I can't stay. I need to find St. Uni. I'm sorry, but please don't waste my efforts. I'm not going to let you go. Finn held me back. Let go. I won't. You'll just disappear again if I let you. Then you'll be somewhere I can't reach you. Being with someone other than me. There's no way I can let that happen, right? Cyrus. We finally meet again. Be with me like it was in the Heights. We're partners. We have to cover each other's backs. Yeah, that sounds right. I'm the reason you were assigned to the Hounds. If there's a way to make amends for that, I'd love to. Then we... But I'm serving St. Yune now. I need to be with him. I know it's selfish, but please... Finn, are you listening? <laughs> and there we go. <laughs> yes. You're selfish. Don't care about my feelings or what they've done to me in the hounds. Laughing happily with him. But don't worry. I'm not angry. I forgive you because you're more important than anyone else to me. I couldn't be upset with you. We promised we'd meet again, didn't we? You said it wasn't the last time. You gave me the hope I needed to survive here, Cyrus. So please, stay with me. Is this person really the Finn I knew? His gaze was sharp and empty, like an animal's. The Finn I knew was gone. What happened to you, Finn? What did they do to you? <laughs> oh, you know, I, what do you mean? I look totally normal. You were gone, so... I had to rely on myself. And I became stronger and grew fangs that a hound would be proud of. And I learned how to tear them into someone's throat. There wasn't a single day here that I didn't think about you. I wanted to meet you so badly. 
I kept wishing for it. And then... You came. It's fate, right? We are fated to be together, no matter how far we were apart. Saint Yune is loved by everyone. He has everything. But I have only you. I'm the one who really needs you. And I'm the one you should choose. I won't be a distant memory for you. You are everything to me. You are my past, my present, and my future. I won't let that line be broken. How could things end up like this? I don't want to believe that this is Finn. But no, he was definitely Finn. What did they do to him in the Hounds? It was my fault he had changed so much, but... Finn was now a hound. I'm scared of him now. Scared he might bite my hand when I reach out. Finn. Out of the way. No! <laughs> this is going badly. I really don't want to hurt you. You mean so much to me. I don't want to hurt or scar you. You have to stay pure. Yeah, definitely, and dairy. Finn. I could have drawn my sword and cut him down. I knew that on a rational level, but I couldn't move. I can't just cut down my old partner. L let go. My meek demands were left unheeded, and Finn chuckled. <laughs> If words don't get through to you, well, maybe I have to teach you what I mean, gently and carefully, until you understand my feelings. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Stranger danger, but not really, it's not really a stranger, but he is because he's strange. Ah! I love you, Cyrus. You're mine. Someone... Someone help! Help! Hey, look! There! That uniform is from the Sanctuary District. He's taking her! One of the men grabbed Finn by the shoulder and punched him in the face. Damn, thank you, random strangers. When Finn staggered back, another blow hit him. Don't hold back on the dog. Give it to him! The men began to kick Finn, lying on the ground. Run away, girl! But... Run home, now! <laughs> no. Don't. Don't leave me, Cyrus! Ah! <laughs> we were saved by random guys! He's probably gonna kill them and come back for us in the epilogue after this, but I don't care. I got away for a little bit. <laughs> Before the gentle, careful showing of feelings happened. <laughs> Ay! Ooh. Ah. Ah, Finn, always a pleasure. <laughs> okay. I mean, yeah, that's like standard Yandere fare, the whole, like, you must be pure and I am obsessed with you, blah, blah, blah. But we all knew that already. So it does like extra confirmation. <laughs> I'm a little sus that we didn't get like any CGs with that because we're missing so many CGs in our other category. But alternatively, it could be. Excuse me. I don't know why I've got so much gas. Ugh. Um, it could be that all of those are going to be in the grand end, possibly, which would be fantastic because that means the grand ending is going to be. Fairly substantial. Alright, I'm just like cat and hot bricks over here like I don't know if I believe that Finn could be held down by like two random guys. Or you know, I, I could see Cyrus like running away to start and then her conscience gets her and she's like 
But he was my old partner. I should go back. But her stopping and having like this inner guilt, guilt turmoil thing going on. So it will give Finn time to catch up. And she's like, crap, I should have kept running. <laughs> I mean, what else is interesting is that, yeah, I mean, I was kind of expecting to see other choices in that, but it was just two things from a bad end, two things from a good end. I guess the one in particular is not really a bad end specific. Well, I guess in a way it is. Not talking to Finn is like a big choice. Because <laughs> he just gets so upsetty spaghetti, which I can understand. I mean, even if you're not a Yandere, if, if I heard my old partner came down to the depths and didn't at least say hello, I'd be pretty upset he's spaghetti. <laughs> I wouldn't go and, like, seek them out and bop them over the head, but... Come on, game, I know you. Yeah, I know you. <sighs> I knew it couldn't be true. I'd run away as fast as I could. I'm saved. If those men hadn't come, Finn would have... Finn. Don't leave me. I couldn't forget his screams. I'd wanted to stay there, but had instinctively run away. There he goes. My sweet boy. Before he got hounded. Anyway, I'll have a new workplace, and I want to do my best there. You shouldn't give up either. <laughs> That's true. I'm sorry. Until the next time, we will meet again. That the Finn from back then no longer existed. Finn had changed, but it's my fault he changed. If it hadn't been for me, he wouldn't have been sent to the Hounds. If it hadn't been for the Fitch for the Evans family, none of this would have happened. He would still be living in the Heights. <laughs> that was... A gunshot. This guy is tough. He's still not dead. Damn, they shot him too and he's still, like, going. Phew, Finn, you beast. Put the stupid gun away. Do you want him to die already? I think we should break his fingers next. Nah! He's been through worse, unfortunately. The men were still subjecting Finn to abuse on the ground. His red cloak was torn to shreds. I can't change Finn back. But I can't abandon him either! There was a whole group of them. I had no chance in a straight fight. I need to be swift and careful. I blended into the night to approach the group. Nice way to thank your saviors. <sighs> the weakness in Finn's voice hurt my heart. Don't die. Don't die, okay? I snuck up on the group and reached for the hilt of my sword. Stop hurting him! What? Hey, aren't you the girl from earlier? Get away from him! Otherwise, I'll cut you down. We saved you, you ungrateful bitch. And looking at your clothes, you gotta be from the heights yourself. The men glared aggressively at me. Good! Ha! I rammed the hilt of my sword into the stomach of one of the men carrying a club. Ah! I immediately switched targets. Be calm, but quick! I hit the next one with the flat of my blade. Ah! I leveled the tip at the man squirming on the ground and warned him. Get lost before I shed your blood. Fuck. They accepted their defeat and vanished like smoke. I'm glad this didn't drag out. I wasn't too happy with their methods, but they had saved me. 
I felt sorry for attacking them and sheathed my sword, turning my attention to Finn. Yeah, you're gonna feel sorrier in a minute. Finn! Ah. Ah. Good. He's still breathing. <laughs> you came. To save me. Yeah. I'm sorry I ran away. These wounds are serious. They have to be treated right away. I'll take you to Elkreed's house. Can you stand? Elkreed? Yes, he governs this district. He should be able to save you. I'll steady you. Let's go. <clears throat> Finn pressed his lips together and stood up. I tried to support him, but he was too heavy, and we both tumbled and fell. Uh, I'm sorry. Are you okay? I'll do a better job. Let's try having you stand up. Uh. I heard a sharp cut in the silence. It happened so fast that I couldn't process it. What just... My stomach hurt. The burning pain spread through my body. Cyrus? There's blood. Blood? I looked down at Finn. Blood was dripping on his face. Oh no, Finn, I'm so sorry. When did Finn get those wounds? No, that isn't his blood, I realized. It was mine. Ah! I realized I'd been shot and pressed my hand against my stomach. The pain was searing, enveloping my whole body. Cyrus! Finn caught me when I collapsed. Stay here! Don't die! Please! Man, we even came to help you! Ungrateful bitch! Ha 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 ha! You bastard! Finn laid me down and drew his sword. Damn, even as beat up as he is. He rose unsteadily and faced the man. You think that toy's gonna do you much good? A shot went through Finn's left shoulder. Finn didn't even blink and close the distance to the man. You think that toy will do you much good? He lopped the man's hand clean off. Ah! Then he plunged his sword into the man's stomach. A fountain of blood came gushing out. Finn slammed his shoulder into the man, heedless of blood spattering onto him. The man was lying on the ground now. Finn put his boot on the man's right arm. You won't need this anymore. He put his weight behind his sword and thrust down on the arm. It snapped off like a little branch. Ah! Shut the hell up. Finn glared at the man and drew his sword across his throat. The man twitched as he died, and blood ran out onto the ground in all directions. Yeah, I think he definitely got him. Even when he was dead, Finn stabbed the motionless corpse. Finn. With every swing, he seemed a little less human. It was too pitiful. I forced myself to call his name through the pain. Finn, stop it! Finn snapped back. He thrust his sword aside and ran over. He placed my head on his lap and reached for my wounded stomach. Hey, this seems like deja vu. Aw, oh, we did it! We got the picture now! <laughs> Game. Game, I swear. The ultimate troll. Well, at least he's smiling. He got to be with her at the end. <laughs> Oh no, you've lost so much blood. I can't stop it. <laughs> Look, I'm full of blood as well. Finn put his blood-stained fingers on my cheek. I could taste iron in the blood that reached my lips. Finn, you... How did you feel about me? I trusted you. You were a wonderful partner. I had so much I wanted to ask and say, but my mouth didn't obey. 
My thoughts began to fade as well, swallowed by the haze in my mind. Good night, Cyrus. It's all right. I'll be there soon as well. Just wait for me. We will always be together. Aww. Well, that was kind of sweet in the end. <laughs> if you want someone to get revenge for you, for killing you, a uh, alien dairy is the way to go. Alright, what was that one called? Bad at- ooh, 90%. A thread unbroken. Appropriate. Definitely appropriate. And I, I, I assume that went into the others. Yes. Yes. Okay. So we've got four more pictures. Hmm. Okay, so we've got two more other bad ends. We could potentially get two more CGs with that, which would only leave us two CGs. I thought this scrolled, but it doesn't. It leaves us two CGs to work with for the finale. Because we've got everything else, I believe. Yes. Okay. Interesting. Okay. I mean, that wasn't actually as bad as I thought it was going to be. It started out, like, kind of dicey, but by the end, I'm like, you know what, Finn? Thank you. I'll, I'll see you in the afterlife. <laughs> All right, so that was bad ending number one. I will see you for other bad end number two.